Yo, 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 yo. Hey, what's up, guys? How you doing? It's Carter. Hope you're having a great day. Beautiful day over here in sunny California, per usual. Got a new coat for you. Coming in real hot from Brian. He sent this over to me, and I've been playing it for a little while. Yeah, it's an awesome coat. I really, really dig this one. It's based on the Flappy Bird style gameplay, which is actually a pretty popular gameplay back in the day. Uh, but Brian added a bunch of new features to it, not only in the way he designed it and developed it, but just in terms of the way the monetization cycles work. It's really, really cool. And what I want to do today is I want to make sure that you guys see and get a perspective on everything that this thing has. So I'm going to walk through this step by step, show you everything it has, so that when we're done here, you have a very informed decision and you can make this purchase and be super pumped about it and hit the ground running when you do. So what I want to do is I'm going to fire this thing up and we're going to see it's flip the bird. Obviously, no pun intended. Uh, maybe there is definitely a pun intended. And it's going to take a second. It's just my uh, the screen takes a little bit to, to load on the computer here. And so you can see the chart boost pops up right here. Full screen chart boost. You, know, you guys all know how that works. I'm going to close that down. And then what also happens, you guys didn't see this because I've been playing this for a few times, is that sometimes there'll be a pop-up here that we can actually upsell a couple purchases that he has where it says, oh, hey, do you want to get five stars and a bunch of coins? And that purchase will just be there. So that's available, which is pretty exciting. I'm going to click on the lower left here. And this shows the achievement. So in Game Center, this shows the kind of achievements you can have. These are native to the game, but this is also built into Game Center, which I will show you. So this just shows you here, you know, what your active ones are, what your all of them are, and whatever. So I'm going to go back. Go back there. You can see it says tap to change. You tap them, it shows you got a few different birds that you can unlock and, and, and play as different characters. Same with a few of the other games that we have. Uh, for sale on, on Blue Cloud, very popular gameplay. It does really well with in-app purchases. So that's a, that's a great one to have. And I like how it's moving. It catches the eye. Over on the right here, what we have is we have an About page. So that actually shows up where the chart boost at. So you get some of your impressions up. Um, this is a great place to show some advertising. You can show other apps you do um, that's really important. You can also see that he has uh, the Facebook and the feedback forms, which is huge for reviews, guys. If you really want to get five-star reviews, having this kind of feedback area in a Facebook place is enormous because it allows people who like your app to share it. And then it also allows people that want it. You know, they might rate it two or three stars, but they're going to they're reach out to you first. Super helpful. You get great customer support. Upper right-hand corner, you can see the more games. That's going to be chart boost as well. No need to click that. I'm going to go back. And then I'm going to go up, there's a help button, right? So you click it, and this is just a straight up tour. So it gives you the, um, you know, shows you how to play the game really well. Um, I'm going to go back because that just gives you an intro. Uh, let's look at the upgrades real quick. Tons of really good upgrades here. There's power-ups, there's extras. This is where the, the characters come into play. There's coins and stars and things like this where you can actually continue your gameplay. And I'll show you when we're playing. Uh, there's tons of stuff in there. The remove ads, obviously, because this is a free version. And the restore purchases, lower right-hand corner. If you don't know what that is, that's just uh, an app will require you to have it. So I'm just going to go back here. And then up top is the scores. This is just a, a, a leaderboard. Got the chart boost firing. Um, and then in the lower right corner, you can see that there's a Game Center integration as well. So a little bit of everything in here. It's done really, really well. The coding is awesome. And up in the right-hand corner, the, the sound. I've turned that off just so you guys can hear me. If you want to download the game here for yourself, go for it. More games, Game Center, same sort of stuff. And now we get to the good stuff where we're going to actually play this game. So I'm going to hit play. And so you get some alerts here that show you what your actual achievements are. Wow, that was terrible, Carter. Come on. Like, you can, you, you got to do better than that. So this is a countdown timer, right? This shows the, the urgency of it. And if you click that, you can actually buy more stars right there. Um, that'll take you to an in-app purchase. I'm going to close that because I'm just going to let this play out. But if you did... What that does is it gets people, Subway Surfers really pioneered this model where when you die, you have to buy more coins to keep playing. Instead, I'm going to go to the game over screen. You can see there's a lot of options. I did this on Coconut Craze, if you guys remember, and that was hyper successful. The making the game over screen a really good place to be interactive. Um, up in the left-hand corner, you can also see the, the plus button that's great for upselling the, the coins in the store. Um, and I'm just going to do a new game just so I can, I can redeem myself a little bit. Whoa, how did that happen? God, I am terrible at this game. We're going to do it one more time just because I want you guys to see how this is played. Again, we get the countdown timer. Um, it's you know It works really, really well and that kind of thing. And I'm just going to hit new game right here um, so I can really show you you know my, uh, my flappy skills. Yes, doing it. There we go. Now we're on a roll. And you can see that this isn't, this isn't nearly as sensitive or nearly as difficult as the original, which I actually think is a great thing because as much as the addictive properties of Flappy Birds were there, um, with this one, you're going to get really good retention, which is 
in the long term, much better. Now, one thing we haven't talked about is the fact that this is Cocos 2DX. And with Cocos 2DX, this gets uh, exported from iOS over to Android. Now, what's even better is that the way Brian developed this is that you can use the exact same graphics to, to port that game over. You don't need to get too crazy about changing anything up or anything like that. He made it so it's super easy to port over. You just get, might have to change a few dimensions one time. Uh, super easy to do. And any developer can help you with that, or designer, I should say. And that's what we got. The game is super nice. It plays really, really well. The amount of different themes you can do for this is you know, limitless. Uh, it's really exciting. I think it's awesome the way he's gamified this. And the more you play it, the more you realize that he's put the details in. So that there's actually store uh, pop-ups that come up. There's upsells that happen. It's just done really, really well. So that the people who really want to play and continue to, to consume different things in the game uh, have that opportunity. And they don't need to search too hard to find it. So this is a great one. The price is absolutely amazing. You can see the buttons at the bottom there. Uh, I definitely urge you to buy this one. It's a great way to leverage really good models of gaming, great, get great development, uh, and get creative with the theme so that you can have a real winner. So I hope everyone, feel free to read through the article. Uh, reach out to Brian if you have any questions, and definitely buy this one. This is a great one for the portfolio, and I will be talking to you guys soon. All right, see you later. Carter signing off.